Hey friends, I'm pleased to see you all here again. So welcome back to my YouTube channel. That is the Pro Vlogs Cars. I hope you all are having an amazing time with your loved ones. So today we are going to be presenting a video about the 2023 Citroen C4 Air Cross. So let's get started. The all-new third-generation Citroen C4 was introduced in the 2020 as a subcompact hatchback with the crossover styling cues by the French company could be work on another variant to be placed in the lower parts of the C SUV segment, filling the gap between the recently facelifted C3 Aircross and the C5 Aircross. The rumors from the French media are contradicting, with some claiming that the C4 Aircross or the Sport Cross will be unveiled in the late 2022, and others stating that the project for an extended C4 family has been cancelled. While we can't be sure about the Citroen's plan since no official announcement has made, our colleagues created a speculative rendering of what this French compact SUV could look like. The illustration depicts a high reading model with a taller body than the regular C4 and more muscular fenders putting emphasis on the large diameter wheels. Plastic cladding around the bodywork enhances the adventurous appearance with the color essence on the air bumps and the fog light surrounds the similar to the C4 hatchback sibling. At the front, the C4 Air Cross would most likely get the new dual headlight treatment with the LED graphics being extensions of the double chevron emblem. At the back, the model should have a more conventional roofline compared to the coupe style C4, allowing more headroom for the rear passengers and the larger boot. The rendering shows a rather sporty approach with the high mounted LED tail lights reminiscence for the design of the C4 C5 X flagship if it were given the green light the C4 Air Cross would be based on the Stellantis CMP platform which is shared with the regular C4 and many other vehicles including the Peugeot 208 and Opel Corsa Super Minis and the Peugeot 2008 DS3 Crossback and Opel Mocha BSUVs. This architecture is different from the larger EMP2, which is underpinning the Peugeot's 308 Opel Astra and DS4 compact hatchbacks, plus the larger C3 SUVs of the group. The engine range could include the 1.2 liter Piatek petrol and the 1.5 liter blue HDI diesel with power outputs between the 99 to 153 horsepower. Additionally, a few fully electric powertrains would be a nice addition to the range with the eCMP platform featuring a 50 kilowatt per hour battery and a single electric motor producing 134 horsepower. All variants would be FWD with an optional grip control system standard progressive hydraulic cushions in the comfort oriented suspensions and ADAS for up to level 2 autonomy. A Citroen C4 Air Cross would make sense as more practical alternative to the C4 doubling as an indirect replacement to the discontinued C4 Cactus and the soon to be retired C4 Space Tudor M3. 